friends. I wanted to do a class for you guys since you're not able to come here right now. The level I'm doing right now in this class will be my repeater 5-6 class, which is my Monday at 4-15 class, my Wednesday at 4-15 class, Miss Meredith's Thursday at 4-15 class, and Miss Anna's Saturday at 10-30 class. So we're going to do some tap and we're going to do some ballet. So I'm super excited to get started with you guys. I know you don't typically have a ballet bar at your house, but as you can see, I'm using a chair. So you can use a chair or you can use a countertop, but you can use something. So clear out a little bit of an area and let's start dancing. The first thing we're going to do is we're just going to do a little warm up. So um, everybody have a seat, get your ballet shoes on. I'll turn on some music and we'll get started. I'm just going to get some ballet music on here for us to reach and to stretch. Oh, I think I need to turn that up a little bit louder. I can't hear it very well. Oh, that's better. Okay. Now, let's start with our feet in a butterfly. And let's just fly our butterfly and stretch our feet up and down. Now, let's do rock and roll. Rock side to side. Good job. Rocking and rolling with the music. That's it. legs out in front of us. Good. I'm going to move that chair so I don't bump it. Sit super duper tall and flex your feet. Let's point our toes down. Pull them up. Point your toes down. Pull them up again. Point your toes down. Pull them up. One more time. Toes down. Toes up. Now we're going to open and close our feet. Open and close. Open and close. And open. Close. Keep those legs nice and straight, flat on the floor. Just do your turning from your hips. Good job. Yes. Good. Point those toes down. We're going to let the music continue to play. I want you to reach up to the sky. Stretch down over your toes and put your nose to your knees. Big stretch. Good, now sit up really tall. Flex those feet. Reach down and get up with your toes. Get those toes with those fingertips. There you go. Point those toes down again. Reach up to the sky. Stretch over. Put your nose to your knees. Come back up again. Flex those feet. Touch them with your fingertips. Good job. There you go. Now open those legs to a wide strap. Stretch over with one arm. And come up. Let's go the other way. Point those toes down. Don't let your feet touch the floor. Only your heels. Don't let those toes roll forward. Keep those toes back nice and far. And then come up. Then the other way. Stretch. And then come up. Now what I want you to do is flex your feet and grab those toes. Keep that back nice and tall. Good job. You can do it. Good. Now put your hands on your knees. Point your toes. Flex your toes. Point your toes. Flex your toes. Point your toes. Now walk your hands out. Arch them out as far as you can go. Grab them. Crawl your hands out like caterpillars. Spin your cocoon and fly your butterflies away. Let's do it again. Crawl your caterpillars out. Spin your cocoon and fly your butterflies away. One more time. Crawl out your caterpillars. Spin your cocoon and fly those butterflies away. What color were your butterflies today? I think my butterflies were yellow because yellow is the color of sunshine. And the sun is shining today. So friends, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do our practice. Remember how we do this in dance class? We cross our legs, we put our arms out, and we practice standing up without using our hands. Beautiful. We stand right up. And we also practice sitting down without using our hands. So we do a big curtsy and then go back. We're going to try it again. Up we go. And stand with your feet in first position. That's beautiful. Now, as I said, I have a chair because 
most of you probably don't have a ballet bar in your house, so I'm going to use this chair as my ballet bar. And the first thing we're going to do is, just like in class, we're going to start with tendus. Let me get my music ready, and we will have our tendus happening. I'm sorry, we're not doing tendus. What was I thinking? We always start with plies and releves. Good grief, Miss Lynn. That is not right. We're doing our plies first. Sorry about that, girls. Let me get the right song. Now make sure you're standing super tall. Hold the bar with one hand and the other hand is on your hip. We're gonna do our plie. And then stretch the prize up your toe. Up and down. Then we're in a plie. And stretch, rise up to your toes. Up and down. We're in first position. Make sure your heels are touching and your toes are apart. Good. Release those knees up. And keep that bottom tucked under while we do our plies. Good job. Up and down. And plie. And stretch. Up to your toes. Elevate and down. And plie. And stretch. Elevate. Up and down. Good, girls. Now point your toe and put your feet in second position. Keep that back tall. That bottom tucked under. And we're going to do it in second position. Plie and stretch. Rise to your toes up and down. Remember when we do our elevates, we keep our heels forward up and down. Good friends. Plie and stretch and rise up. Heels down and plie and stretch. Rise up and down. We're going to do four more. Plie and stretch. Rise up and down and plie and stretch. Rise up and down. Last two, plie and stretch. Rise up, up and down. Last one, plie. Get as high as you can on those bent toes and come down. Good, friends. Close your feet together. Now we're going to do our tendus. Let me change the music for you. When we do our tendus, friends, we're going to make sure we really, really stretch our toes. So we're going to hold the bar again, and we're going to stretch forward one, and we're going to close in first. Then we're going to stretch two, close in first. Then we're going to stretch three, close in first. Then we're going to do our plie. And then we're going to do that to the side. One, close together. And two, close together. And three, close together. And a plie. And if you notice, when I was going to the side, I don't go straight to the side. I go slightly forward, just the position. And first, wherever my toe is pointing, we're just going to continue in that direction. Then we're going to do three to the back. One, and close together. Two, and close together. See that straight leg? Three, and close together. And a plie. Then we're going to do the side again. I'll turn on the music, and we can do it together, friends. Here we go, get ready. Ooh, that music caught me off guard. Let me try it again. All right, gotta move faster. All right, here we go. Tendu, close first. And stretch it, close first. Three, close first. And a nice demi plie. And stretch to the side. Side, close first. And side, close first. Good job, friends. Side, close first. Here's another plie. And now to the back, stretch back, close first, and back, close first, and back, close first, demi plie, down, and stretch to the side again, side, close first, and side, close first, and side, close first, and a nice plie, and stretch. Now we're going to turn around, hold the bar with the other hand, or your chair. And we're going to do your left leg. So get ready. We have to be balanced. Time to front. Close first. Again, two. Close first. And three. Close first. Give me a nice plie. And stretch to the side. Side. Close first. To the side. Close first. Stand nice and tall. Side. Close first. And a plie. And stretch to the back. Back. Close first and back. Remember you're going straight to the back on the side of the big toe 
and a plie. Last time, to the side, side. Close first, keep that heel forward, side. Close first, one more, side. Close first, and a plie. And drop your arms. Beautiful, friends. That is so good, we only have, I think, one more thing here at the bar, and then we're gonna move out to the center, and then we may go back to the bar, play a game. It's gonna be awesome. The next thing we're gonna do is our rond de jambe. And we've been practicing this, friends. Remember how we, um, this is the one that's like cutting the pizza. So we slide our foot to the front. We slide our foot to the side. We keep that heel forward and then we slide to the back and we close in first. Remember doing that? Rond de jambe, we also call it cutting the pizza or the pie. So think about your favorite pie that you like to eat and we will do our rond de jambe. Alright, here we go. That is not the right song. Goodness gracious, here we go. Oh, this is much better. And to the front, then side, now back. Close first, again, front and side, now back. And first, keep going, front and side, to the back. Close first, keep that bottom tucked under, front, then side, now back, and close first. Now we're going to go to the back, and then the side, and then the front. Close first, three more, back, and side, to the front, close first, two more, back, then the side, and the front, close first, and back. to the other side. We'll do our left leg now, friends. Good job. Keep that back nice and tall. We stretch front, then side, then back, and we go to first, and front, then side, and back, and first. Two more. Front, and side, to the back. Close first. Last one. Front, and side, First, how are you doing? You hanging in there? Back, side, front, close first. Two more, back, and side, and front, close first. Last one, friends, back, and side, and front, close it first, and the plie. Good job. Okay, we've been working at the bar for a while now. Let's try something different. Let's do our rabbit dance. We've done the rabbit dance, uh, we did it this week, I think, but let's do the rabbit dance. This was super fun around Easter time. So it's gonna take me just a second to change the CD. So start thinking about what kind of name you wanna give your rabbit, because you're gonna be a rabbit and jump around the room. So think of a good rabbit name, and we will do our rabbit dance. Here we go. Let's pretend we're rabbits. Stand up, stretch out your paws, and get ready to hop. Ready to hop, friends? Let's hop all we'll around your house. Hop and Don't hop on anybody. Rabbits dance along. They can wiggle their noses. They can hop their feet. They can pop their ears. They can wiggle their tails. Rabbits dance along. Rabbits dance along. Now let's hop. And sing their song. Good job, friends. Let's hop up all day long. Sing this song as 
right now. Our feet are in first position. When you do your tendu passe, we're going to tendu to the side, passe and touch your toe towards your knee, tendu and close. Then the other side, tendu and passe and tendu and close. Other side, tendu and passe and tendu and close. Other side, tendu and passe and tendu and close. That's what we're going to do with our music. You guys know this one. Let's practice it. We want it to look really good when recital time rolls around. Yes, this one is a little tricky. We have to make sure we keep that toe stretched, 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 and keep our knee pointing to the side when we do our passe. Don't point that knee forward. Point it to the side. All right. Have to think really tall. Tendu, passe, tendu, close first. I'm gonna scoot back. Tendu, passe, tendu, close first. Tendu, passe, tendu, close first. Tendu, passe, tendu, close first. Keep going. Tendu, passe, tendu, close first. Tendu, passe, tendu, close first. One more on each side. So you're going to put your arms out and you're going to go one close together, two close together. Then we're going to jump in a square. Jump to the side, jump to the back, jump to the other side, jump to the front. Then we're going to slide again. Slide close together, slide close together. This time we're jumping the other direction. To the side, to the back, to the side, to the front. So we make a square when we jump. So we start in the front, you jump to the side, then the back, then the other side, then the front. So you jump right, 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 or you jump left, 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 left. So let's try that with the music, friends. Good job. Two slides and four jumps. Let's try it. Good. Other way. 
was beautiful, very nice, really, really good. Now I'm going to move this chair just a minute because as you know, in our recital dance, we were starting it. And so you girls know that when we start, we start with marches. And what I want you to do when we start with our marches, I want you to really think about picking that knee up nice and high and having it way up front and pointing that toe down. I don't want to see a flexed foot or a fishy foot. Put that foot right beside your knee. So when we march, we pick those knees up nice and high and point those toes. So I'm going to turn on some music and we're going to do some slower marches and then some faster marches. And we're going to try to keep our feet nice and quiet while we do it. Up and down, up and down, point those toes. Down, up and down, and up, keep those shoulders high. Up and down, and up. You can go backwards if you're really feeling confident. Up and down, up and down, up. Now we can go forward again. Up and down, up and down, and up. And down, and up, and down. Good. So that's a good time to try doing it slowly. Now we're going to speed it up just a little bit. But I still want your toes to be stretching when we do it. Stretch those feet. And remember, we want super quiet feet. Like this. some tap shoes on. Let's do that. If mom says don't put tap shoes on, you can either put on your regular shoes or just keep your ballet shoes on, but we need to do whatever mom says because we don't want to scratch up the floors with your tap shoes because we have special floors here, but mom's got nice floors at home and we don't want to mess them up. So I'm going to put my tap shoes on and we'll do the next thing. And remember girls, we've talked about this in dance class when we're changing our shoes. Sometimes it seems easy to pull the loops when you're untying your shoes. But did you know that if you pull the loops instead of pulling the strings, you're gonna make a knot. We don't want a knot, we want it to come right off. So make sure when you are untying your shoes that you pull the little stick and strings and not the loops and that, ooh, I missed. And that will keep you from making knots in your shoes. So I'm gonna get rid of these jazz shoes and put them aside. We are gonna get our chair back in here for our pretend bar. And I am gonna get some music for us for the next thing. The first thing we're gonna do, friends, is we are going to tap our toes. We're just gonna tap. And remember, when we're tapping, we're just tapping our toes. Just your toe, not your whole leg, because that makes it really slow. So we're going to turn on some music, and we're going to tap eight times to the front, then the side, then the back. Ooh, it's fast. Get that toe out. Let's tap. Here we go. Ready? Yeah. 
working on a step and dance class that's gonna be in the recital dance. Shh. And that step is one, two, three, toe. So put your arms out, because we're gonna seesaw those feet. Right now, just march your feet three times. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, toe. One, two, three, go. Now, we can do it standing in place, but we can also do it, I'm gonna move my chair again. We can do it moving side to side. So it goes like this. One, two, three, toe. One, two, three, toe. One, two, three, toe. One, two, three, toe. So it's exactly the same thing as before. We just go side to side with those three steps. So let's turn some music on and practice that, friends. Looking good, I bet. Looking good. Let's try it. Okay, we're going to try it slow, and then we're going to try it fast. Ready? Here we go. The 
mambo. We're doing the mambo. So this is called the side mambo. We're going side to side. You can go front and back, and we'll learn that later. But for now, we are going side to side. So we have side mambo, side mambo, side mambo, side mambo. Good job. Now, if you're really feeling confident once your feet get going, you can take your hand and you can push and then come back. Push and then come back. So you push your hand out to the side as you step, and then you bring it down and you come back. Push, come back. Push, come back. So we're going to try that with some music too. Here we go, girls. Oh, let's do it without our hands first. Just do our feet. Ready? Go. 